Hello guys, welcome back to another brand new data recovery software review video. To recover your data, you don't need to spend a single penny or you don't need to buy a paid software. You can recover your data for 100% free just using some Windows command prompt. So if you are a relatively pro user, you can follow this article. Let me show you guys. And guys, here is the article and using this article, you can recover your Windows deleted or corrupted data for free so this is the command prompt you need to follow to recover your data this kind of command from recovery tricks does work but it need a lot of time and patience and you need to be a pro user to recover your data using command prompt but if you need something simple you can go for a data recovery software and today in this video we're going to review and test this dbac hard drive recovery expert for windows also this software available mac and today in this video guys we're going to download the software and test it on my pc so guys let's begin the video so guys welcome back to my desktop pc and here is the url for downloading the software imyphone.com windows data recovery and you can click on this free download link to download the software and install it so let's click on the free download downloading some software i think it's downloaded let's click on to install yes agree it's term and condition and if you want to do some customized installation you can do that too so now let's install it it will take some time depending on your internet speed successful installation Let's open the software and start. Using this iMyPhone debackup for Windows software, we can recover deleted or corrupted data from internal and external storage as well as we can recover deleted data from recycle bin, desktop or any other folder. Here is the Scandix 8GB pen drive and today we try to recover some data from this pen drive. So let's insert the pen drive into the USB port. Insert it. And here we have some color grades file, some document, some videos, some pictures, okay. So now guys we're going to delete everything from this pen drive. Let's select everything and click on delete. Delete. So there is nothing on the pen drive. Everything is deleted. Now guys we're going to recover those deleted data from this pen drive, e pen drive. So here is all of my deleted data so let's click on it that it will scan all of this file so as you see guys it find all of my files a little bit one by one so can we review it yeah it able to preview the image and as you see guys the pen drive is completely empty there is nothing on this pen drive but the software is able to find all of this file that we previously deleted from the pen drive to recover all of these videos data or not it also finds some video can we play one of the video let's check it guys play it wow it's playing the video 36% DPS can complete it, 2.75 GB, outer 7.45 GB. So it will take some time debating a pen drive size and computer and USB speed. So guys, finally the scan is completed. If some file were not found, please recover the found ones first, then go back and try again. So let's see whether we can recover our document. So here's the video documents, all of the notes. Can we preview this file? Wow, this is the PDF file. I think this kind of file is not recoverable. Unable to preview, you can recover it to have a further check. So guys, let's recover some of the video. MP4, it's so many files are there. So I'll recover a couple of files. Some document, let's recover all of this PDF file. Excel file, JPEG, okay. So recover all of the JPEG photo, so 1.8. 8gb so now recover okay so please log in or sign up so i need to purchase a plan to uh, recover my data it's not free now guys we need to log in here and if you don't have an account you can sign up here so let's do a sign up and so i put my email address here create account dbackup for pc 
on trial mode we can scan preview data and recover up to 100 mb data increase to 200 after sharing okay so if i share i can recover 200 mb data now if you want to purchase the full version it will cost you now what 60 dollar for one month one year for 80 dollar lifetime for 100 dollar after sign up i need to put my registration code to register it so place my registration code here and okay so the member account has been bound to the registration code successfully okay so now i have a one year license that's it now we can recover the data recover so now i'm going to save it on desktop recover okay so now data all of this data is copying on this recovery folder So all of this data are copying from the pen drive. Congratulations files recover complete and, and here is all of my recovered file that I selected. This is the document, PDF files, this is Excel file and here is photos. All of the photos are showing here. Photo and here is some video. So the video is working properly. So guys, as you see how easy it is to recover deleted data from a pen drive. Within a few click, I able to recover all of the data that is inside the pen drive using dbackup for Windows data recovery software. So if you guys accidentally delete any data from your PC, from your SSD, hard drive, pen drive, any kind of memory storage device you delete your data accidentally you can try to recover those data using deep backup for windows it's a good software now this software we have a option to recover data from recycle bin so if you put some data on recycle bin and accidentally we empty the recycle bin uh, then uh, if we want to bring all of this data back we can use this software to recover data from deleted recycle bin this time we're going to test it guys whether we're able to recover data from the recycle bin or not now let's delete this file delete now i deleted this folder and it's put into the recycle bin and if i accidentally empty the recycle bin can we recover all of this uh, data deleted data from the recycle bin using iMyPhone phone backup for windows recovery software so first empty this recycle bin so all of this data are gone now uh, select a specific location recycle bin we're going to select it and it will quick scan the folder so it found all of my previously deleted videos it's a png file logo 3 this is my logo yeah, you can preview this one. Yeah, this is also open. Let's see some JPEG file. No, unable to preview. Yeah, this file is working, so we can recover the file. So select the file and we'll recover it. Desktop, okay. So video MTS. On my C drive, I don't have much free space and that create a problem. So while I like empty the recycle bin and same time Windows is reading and continuously writing on the C drive. And when I try to recover those deleted data uh, from the recycle bin, which is on the C drive too, some of the data already get overwritten. So those data don't overwritten, I able to recover it, but the, those data, those big video files, easily get overwritten and I am not able to recover it. So if you will accidentally empty data from any other drive, not on the drive where your Windows is installed, except that drive, you can easily recover your deleted recycle bin data using iMyPhone dbackup for Windows data recovery software. And guys, I want to thank iMyPhone to sponsor this video and I am going to do another video on Android phone, also iPhone, how to recover data from Android phone and as well as iPhone. 
and here is to another recovery software from iMyphone iMyphone dbackup for android and iMyphone dbackup for ios and i'm going to review these two software on my upcoming videos I get a lot of requests from you guys to recover deleted data from your phone. You will accidentally delete it, then you are not able to recover it. So in my upcoming video, I will show you guys how to recover and delete data from Android phone as well as iPhone. So stay tuned for the video. So guys, that's a review and testing of iMyPhone the backup for Windows recovery software. Hope you guys like this review video and if you guys like it make sure you smack a big thumbs up on this video and if you guys want to download the software link is in the description below that's being said my name is obj i'm signing out and i will meet you on my next video till then bye bye